Stan Gibalisco here, proprietor and operator of amateur radio station W1GV Whiskey One Golf Victor. What you're hearing, well, it's getting a little faint now, is a high speed code transmission. Somebody's carrying on at a good 45 words a minute or so. I haven't heard that for a long time. This is on 14.039 megahertz. There's a little slower one. Now what I'm showing you here is the DigiPan display of what you're hearing. You can clearly see the CW passband here and you can clearly see the signal. And that's sort of cool because I zoom out here and you get a more panoramic view of the cave here. But you can see where the signal is in the passband very easily. And that uh, this is a 500 hertz wide filter. Extends roughly from 400 hertz to 900 hertz. I don't know if you can read those numbers. But you can tell when you're tuned to the center of that passband. So when you narrow the filter down, and now I believe it's uh, 250 hertz wide, from about 550 hertz to 800 hertz, I can be sure to center the signal in there. So that in the event, but I want to narrow the filter down even more to 100 hertz wide. I'll still be able to hear the signal. It'll be in the center because on this ICOM IC746 Pro, the passbands and CW always remain at the same center frequency, regardless of how wide you make them. Back to 500 hertz again. So we can, now there's an awful lot of noise on this band, which is kind of good for this display. Because it clearly shows the pass band for you, as well as the signal. Now we're down to a 250 hertz wide filter. Now down to only 100 hertz wide. So I want to make sure always to center the signal at the uh, center of the passband there. And that's, uh, generally speaking, that's about 680 hertz, which is a, a pitch that I like. You can adjust that on the IC746 Pro, too, by the way. Just for fun, let's go up and look at, um, see if I can find any of those WSJT signals. Well, I'm not hearing any. Oh, here they are. that the coolest doggone sound? I mean, that is just the coolest thing. I want to get on that mode, and I'm going to use my little Arduino board when I learn how to program it to synchronize my computer with WWV so that I can use this mode, because it's a synchronous mode you need to have you need to have synchronization in order to make it work. You time synchronized with the other station. I think that's just totally cool. Well, I'll sign off for now. I won't bore anymore. Now, see when the signal goes away, the noise comes back up. The uh, automatic gain control kicks out. And uh, there they come again. Stan Gibalisco, W1GV, Whiskey One Golf Victor. Signing off from the Black Hills of South Dakota, 73.
and so long.